My first impression on a 9.0 battery is this thing's got some power. I mean, really, it's comparable to having a plug-in grinder or a plug-in hammer drill. You got all the power you need in a 9.0. No matter what we were cutting, there was plenty of power there. I was actually surprised how much power there was. We started using the 9.0s and I seen pure power out of them. It's definitely meant for some heavy-duty usage. You're not going to get that out of any of the other stuff. It's hard to believe that the 9.0 isn't plugged in. It's a lot of hammer drilling and a lot of heavy grinding. Performance is equal to a corded tool all day long. I'd say it's almost twice the life of any other battery tool that I've used. I can put one battery in and use it all day, same as a cord. I've been using the 9.0 for cotton plywood for the rough deck. Been using it for about a day and a half before one of the uh, batteries would die on us. The amount of power that you're getting out of those new tools that we got, they're all brushless. They work excellent. And the 9.0 battery on top of it just sort of makes it a superior tool. On something like a Super Hog, where you are you know, on a four inch hole running something that requires so much power, the 9.0 battery really performs well. It's actually a luxury, the 18 volt series. Everything is compatible, the batteries interchange. A 9.0 battery it actually works, it keeps its power and sustainability throughout the whole day. When you put them both together with the 9.0 and then the fuel brand, it's just gonna outlast everybody else. The 9.0 definitely has been engineered for heavy duty work. It's the real deal.